to come out today and support Lexus and the Weinstein Company short film series? It's amazing that technology is giving young filmmakers, up and coming filmmakers, the ability to get their stuff out there. But you know, there's still a lot of roadblocks to getting your film seen and uh, having people support it. So um, it's amazing that Harvey Weinstein, I mean, a giant in the industry, is going to come out and, and give it a platform and, and bring up these young filmmakers. So, of course, I come out and support. And the theme this year is Life is Amazing. When you hear that term, what initially comes to mind? Um, life is amazing. You know, I'm a, I'm a scrappy kid from South Africa, and uh, I never thought in a million years that I would be walking red carpets and people would be asking me questions. <laughs> um, I, dr I dreamt about it. I stood on my grandma's porch and imagined crowds, but um, you never know where life is going to take you. I could never have imagined this, so I agree. <laughs> and of course, we're just days away from Oscars, Oscar night. Who? What are some of the films you're rooting for, some of the actresses? Oh my goodness, oh, this is such a hard question because I've got like, I was just saying to one of the other interviewers, I've got pilot season brain, it's completely, uh, let's see, um, I love Jessica Chastain, I just think she's ethereal and um, I don't know, she transports uh, the audience. Um, what else? Uh, Any favorite movies from, from this year's lineup? Silver Linings, Django, Argo. How could I forget <laughs> Django Unchained? That movie slightly changed my life. <laughs> I just saw it. Um, gosh, Jamie Foxx has really held his own. Um, and here, what a renaissance man to come out of sketch comedy um, and to approach these massive roles. And of course, you know, Quentin Tarantino, it's a lot of... Um, I wouldn't say gore, but it's uh, it's, it's pretty bloody in there. Sure, <laughs> but, I would say gory. The appropriate word. Is that it? <laughs> and then any new projects coming up that you're working on? Uh, yes, really excited about Hemlock Grove for Netflix. Um, much like House of Cards, available April nineteenth. All thirteen episodes. Uh, you can binge watch it over the weekend. Yeah. Um, uh, the Seventh Son. It's it'll be out in the fall. Uh, fantasy. Uh, um, Julianne Moore, Jeff Bridges, uh, I get to pe play kind of a badass, uh, ass-kicking, witchy, <laughs> I'm not sure anybody will recognize me, <laughs> actually, my costume is pretty, pretty incredible, so, yeah. Well, congratulations.